And I'll tell you what I'll do. I'm gonna go in the bedroom, put my boots on, and we'll just go out there and get some snow off the car. Okay, look you guys, look at this perfect snow. This is the perfect powdery snow to make. Look at that, see, oh, see how powdery look. See how beautiful and powdery. That is the perfect snow for making snow cream. Way. Sunglasses out of my way. But there you go. Perfect. I used to actually make you cooking YouTube cooking videos, to tell you the truth, so I should have known right where to put everything. So I'm still putting in the cream. I'm trying to work this down. In this bowl, um, Pam, how much sugar do you think? Maybe a cup? Well, I'm using up all this heavy cream. This is what I was, I was gonna make two quiches with that. But um, I'm using it all up to make snow cream. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and put get some vanilla. We're gonna put a little dab of vanilla if I can find it, because that's not something I use very often because I don't cook sweets a lot because I don't eat sugar. But we are gonna eat some sugar tonight. I the vanilla. Uh, here we go. Got the vanilla. I'm thinking maybe uh, probably for this amount, I'm gonna say about a. Sorry. Here we go. About a tablespoon of vanilla, I think. this amount and we need a pinch of salt so I'm gonna put a pinch of salt that's enough salt and now the sugar let me get the sugar out and I'm thinking a cup I'm thinking about a cup for this amount of snow cream To be able to mix it really well. I pour some more of this in here. <laughs> that is going to be some rich snow cream with all that heavy cream in it. And if I need it, I've got more half and half in my refrigerator. I always have half and half. See, look at that. It's already, see how it's already starting to look like ice cream. But look at it. And I'll taste it once I get it mixed up really good here. I'll taste it and then I'll know if it's got enough sugar in it or not. And you see why I got so much snow because look how it, you know, I got this whole bowl running over of snow and look how much snow cream I end up with. Look at that. And I would strongly recommend if you live in a city where there's a lot of industry, yeah, don't be eating the snow. Here where I live, here where I live, there's not really, that snow was, is absolutely pristine. Look at that. There we go. There's the snow cream. You guys see it? I'll hold it up there. And I'm the only one that lives here, so I can take a bite right out of the bowl, and it doesn't matter. Let's see if it's got enough sugar. Mmm, 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 mmm. More sugar. Definitely more sugar. Probably about twice as much as I put in. Because it's not very sweet. Mix that in. And 
that is some pretty snow cream right there. Look at that. And now I have frozen snow cream before. It's not real good after it's frozen. Mm-mm-mm. That is so good. Yeah, Pam. Great idea. 